everyone, my name is Mina, and this vlog is going to be of Wizard World Comic Con. Um, it's Ohio's Comic Con, it's down in Columbus, Ohio. This is my second time going, but I'm going to show you guys around. It's going to be fun. I hope you guys all enjoy. It might not be a lot of talking, it might be just a lot of moving around, etc. But I do hope you enjoy. Have a good day. I have two here for Firefly Serenity. Wash, and you can't take this guy from me. As well as three Supernatural pins. I love the middle one. It's probably one of my favorite quotes. Definitely one of them. And I got these two magnets as well. One is Ravenclaw, because that is my house. And honestly, there's not enough Ravenclaw merch out there. I really wish there was more. And As You Wish, from The Princess Bride. If you haven't seen that movie, you really need to because it's such a classic. 
It's so cheesy, but it's such a classic. I also got these patches. This is Firefly Serenity. I am to misbehave. And I believe that is Serenity in Mandarin, but I'm not 100% sure. And if it's upside down, I apologize. The police box, of course. Doctor Who. This one was adorable. Hello, my name is Groot. Guardians of the Galaxy. A Loki patch. I actually got that for one of my friends at work. There was nothing Loki at the con. That was one of the few things I found. I'm glad I found it. And this rock, paper, scissors, pew pew, Deadpool. Classic. And this is the person who made it, SDS Threads. And I have to say, this guy was really cool. And I am more than happy to support his brand. I got these as well. They are six year outdoor finals from what I've read. I got this one, I believe it's Niku, I think is how you pronounce her name. I got that for one of my best friends ever because she absolutely loves Miku. And I got this for one of my other friends. He plays Dungeons and Dragons. I don't understand what it means, but I was told that he would understand and laugh. So I thought I'd get it for him. I also got these. They are really, really cute drawings. Um, it is from supergrouphugs.com. I can zoom in. That is the artist and the website. Let's just you check them out because it's amazing. This one is, of course, Markiplier, the tiny box tin. It's downright adorable. Hagrid and a dragon. Toothless and Hiccup. John Locke from Sherlock because John Locke is amazing. And this is just downright adorable because it fits. And Totoro, and I forget her name, but it's from my neighbor Totoro, or Toro Toro, however you pronounce it, from Studio Ghibli. All of these are so adorable. I have bigger ones that I will show you next from the same artist. And here are the bigger ones. It's too big for the playmat, so sorry about that. I love this one, and I'm surprising my sister with it. And I'm going to tell her that she can't watch this video until I give her her present because she's going to love it. For the next one, pin shifting. It is Avatar The Last Name Badger. It's so adorable. I apologize for being nasally. I have been laying down most of the day. So my allergies are a little awry. Next one. And the last one, Harry Potter. It's downright adorable. That's all I can say to all of these. So you really need to check out supergrouphugs.com. You will not regret it, trust me. I also got this comic book. It's actually the first comic book I have ever bought, ever. And I'm not going to spoil anything. You all need to check it out, it's amazing. It's called Teleport. And this is the creator and the artist, etc. A little sneak preview. And that's all you get because I am not going to spoil anything for you guys. If you really are interested in this, if it sounds good to you, I do suggest you check them out. This is the website as far as I can tell. And this is the summary. And it comes with a free print. I got the Supernatural one. I thought it was really cool. This this guy has some really unique talent. And I'm supporting him because I think every artist out there deserves support in some way, shape, or form. Because who doesn't want that? I also got this shirt. It is downright amazing. Because if you look, ghost, rider. This guy is very unique at how he does his shirts. It is called redchapterclothing.com. They are ambigrams. The description for ambigrams is, ambigrams are mind-blowing works of lettering art 
that can be read both forward and upside down. Mark Palmer is highly regarded as the most prominent ambigram artist in the world. We've collaborated closely with Marvel to create a one-of-a-kind collection that pairs Mark's famous ambigrams with Marvel's iconic superheroes and films. That's kind of cool. You should all check him out. He's really cool. This art's really cool too because it's the same both ways. I have one last thing to show you guys. Like I said before, there's not enough Ravenclaw stuff, so I saw this and I did not care about the price. It was not that badly priced either, but I had to get it because Ravenclaw comes with a bag and one of these. And in here is a piece of clothing and a little surprise. And I'm going to show you what's in here first. What we have in here is this little guy. He's so cute. He's a little crocheted ball. It's downright cute is what I think it is. And I think there's a little bit of stuffing inside. There's also this. And there's also this. Uh, oop, it's upside down. Can't see it very well, but it's a Ravenclaw crust inside a there it is. Inside one of these, it's a little magnet with a stone. Next up is one of these things. I forget the name of it, but it's like paracord something. It's a keychain thingy. I'm not entirely sure what it's called. Please let me know down below because it's going to bug me till I figure it out. Next, we have a necklace. Let me take it out for you. And we have the first necklace. It's really cute. It's kind of heavy, but it's cute. And we've got another one. This one I think I like the most. It's a golden snitch necklace. That is so cute. Now on to the bag. 